I was excited to hear that Paul Takach would like to try the paragliding harness with climb assist, but I was also a little bit confused. I always thought of the Scout Zero as a product designed for the frustrated pilots who don't have a mountain to take off nearby. But Paul doesn't have this problem, he can fly as much as he wants in Austria or Colombia. So why did Paul eventually show up in our workshop? So Paul liked it and he liked it despite flying in shitty, windy, turbulent conditions in the evening and he liked it so much that he decided to stay overnight. Uh, his next flight was much better. He did a, a few touch and goes and then he continued to fly for more than an hour in very, very weak thermals, switching the engine on and off. But the best part of Paltakach staying overnight was that we found ourselves sitting on our porch in the night with stars on the sky and the moon reflecting on the surface of the water in our pond, almost like a romantic date. I was speechlessly listening to Paul's stories about his flying experience, like flying 280, 360, 520 kilometers, unimaginable numbers to me, telling me stories about how he was barely skimming the weak thermals or taking off from a window of a medieval castle because that was the only unforested spot on the hill. I was in awe. When Paul asked me a question, I said yes, and I, I could see that he's very surprised by my answer. So I really had to admit, I had no idea what he was asking. I wasn't listening. I was just watching his gestures, listening to the melody of his words, watching the spark in his eyes. It's so fascinating to listen to Paul talking about paragliding. Paul can see opportunity everywhere. He was talking about using the climb assist to fly places in Hungary that no one has flown before or extending his flight by two hours in the morning and two hours in the evening uses, using those very weak thermals or accomplishing a multi-day adventure that he proposed to the Red Bull team but it was rejected because it required too much logistics and too much support. But now he could do it on his own. That night's conversation was filled with ideas. I'm so grateful for meeting this unique person. I'm inspired for his ability to see opportunities everywhere instead of obstacles. I'm inspired by his trust that it's gonna work instead of worrying how it's gonna fail. And it's so empowering to, see, to hear such a positive feedback from such a respected pilot, effectively a legend. I'm a flying with the Scout Zero, guys. This is pretty awesome. <laughs> the engine is shut down. It's only the wind turning the blade. And I don't have a vario, but it feels like I'm climbing here. Such a nice flight. Woohoo! <laughs>